Hello students now we will be solving memory based questions of gate 19 for more video solution on gate 19 subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click bell icon for instant notification Hello students I'm Prashant and in this video we are going to solve a question of power electronics from gate 2019 uh वैसे तो इस क्वेश्चन को पावर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स से ज्यादा कुछ लेना देना नहीं है इट इज फ्रॉम द बेस फ्रॉम द बेसिक पर्सपेक्टिव यू कैन सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन बट क्वेश्चन थोड़ा ऐसा है कि मतलब इसमें जो टेक्निक यूज करेंगे वे फॉर्म ड्रॉ करके वो थोड़ा uh, वैसे सिमिलर टेक्निक हमेशा हम पावर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स में यूज करेंगे सो द क्वेश्चन इज लाइक दस थ्री स्क्वायर वेव करेंट ईच ऑफ मैग्नीट्यूड हंड्रेड एम्पियर एंड डिस्प्लेस बाई वन ट्वेंटी डिग्रीज from each other are fed to a three phase four wire system the current through the neutral has an rms value of dash amperes so what is the rms value of current through the neutral so that is what we are uh, needed to find out so see here three square waves each displaced by 120 uh, 120 degrees so let us let us draw each of them so let us say 100 volts we have three such square shaped currents right this is one current and another current i am just plotting it here displaced by how much all the three are displaced by 120 degrees apart from each other right therefore i am dividing it into Uh, dividing its time period into segments so that you can recognize what is 120 so if i divide this 180 into three parts this will be 60 degrees and this will be 120 degrees and obviously this is going to be 180 degrees right therefore the other waveform is going to start at 120 so the other one is going to start at 120 like this so in this manner i'm going to complete the entire waveform so students if you look at if you look at the plot if you look at the graph these are the three currents this is ia right so a 120 degrees phase shifted version of ia is nothing but ib and a 120 degrees phase shifted version from ib is nothing but ic matlab ia se ic mein 120 degrees ka phase gap hai aur ib se ic mein 120 degrees ka phase gap hai all these three currents are flown through a star connected three phase four way system three phase four way system ka matlab hi hai star connected राइट थ्री फेज फोर वे सिस्टम कैसा होता है हमेशा स्टार कनेक्टेड ही होता है सो न्यूट्रल तभी हम ले पाते हैं ना इफ इट इज अ डेल्टा सिस्टम देन वी डोंट हैव एनी स्टार वी डोंट हैव एनी न्यूट्रल राइट सो हमें क्या पता करना है दिस इज आई ए आई बी एंड आई सी आर फ्लोइंग थ्रू दिस सिस्टम आई ए आई बी एंड आई सी आर फ्लोइंग लाइक दिस एंड वी नीड टू फाइंड आउट द न्यूट्रल करेंट राइट दिस इज द न्यूट्रल we need to find out ia plus ib plus ic ia plus ib plus ic ka rms value hame find out karna hai so just look at the waveform like this so ia plus ib see here ia is positive 100 and ib is negative 100 from the waveform it is clear that ib is negative 100 what about ic ic is positive 100 so plus 100 minus 100 Plus hundred. Therefore, I A plus I B plus I C, which we are plotting here, is going to be something like this. Plus hundred, right? From zero to sixty, it is plus hundred. At sixty, again the scenario changes. See here, this is minus hundred, this is minus hundred, and this is plus hundred. Plus hundred, minus hundred, minus hundred. You are left with minus hundred, right? This is plus hundred and this is minus hundred. 
right? So after 120, let us see the case. This is plus 100. This is plus 100. This is minus 100, which means effectively it is plus 100, like this, right? After 180, let us see the case. Minus 100, plus 100, minus 100. Therefore, effectively it is going to be minus 100, right? After 180 plus 30, let us see the case. Minus 100, plus 100, and plus 100. It is again going to be plus 100. Therefore, the resultant waveform of IA plus IB plus IC is going to be this way. Copy simple. Hai. Hai na? IA plus IB plus IC is also a square wave. Is also a square wave. But the frequency of this is nothing but frequency is three times of the, the base frequency. Three times of the fundamental frequency. Right? Therefore, I A plus I B plus I C is also a square wave. Is square wave ka RMS value hume calculate karna hai. RMS value calculate karna hai to kya karenge? So square wave ka RMS value aapko pata hi hoga. See the iska amplitude hi ho jayega. Iska DC value kitna hai ka? If you rectify this waveform, the DC value is going to be 100. Then that is nothing but that will straight away reflect into the RMS value. Therefore, I A plus we can write it as I neutral current flowing through the Neutral is asked. I neutral in RMS. I neutral in RMS is going to be 100 amperes. Therefore, the correct option for this question is 100 amperes. The appropriate option is 100 amperes. So, kafi asan hai and ye diya gaya hai do marks mein, uh, do number ke liye. Hope you like the video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.